Hello everyone, today in this video we are going to be ch checking what's inside that smoke detector. Now, I've been watching a lot of videos about what's inside of a smoke detector, but they did not, they, they did not have, they, they didn't have none videos about, uh, about smoke detectors that what's inside of them. So I'm going to be doing a video today about that. So what you want to do is get a chair or something like that and use it as a ladder. What you want to do is get a screw a screwdriver, but it's a flathead, perfect size. Now, you see your smoke detector, right? You take that off. And sometimes they will have wire backup. You have screw. I mean, you have wires inside there, but they took it out. Remember a long time ago, they used to have a cord right here, but they took it out. Yeah, I mean they paste the cord socket right there, but they they did not add a cord. So yeah. So today in this video, we are going to be checking to see. What's inside this smoke detector? And yeah. To learn more about smoke detectors, how they work inside, look around your house and find smoke detectors that they have clips like this. Those are clips. Okay, so now we are going to be checking inside of this smoke detector to see what's inside here. Now, I recommend to not really find well these, these term, these clips. Oh, there's one there. You see it? There's three of them on there. Okay, good. So, Put the camera down, or stand it up, like this, like this, and you see what I'm doing. There we go. Now, you get your smoke detector, right? You get your smoke detector off from a ceiling, and you, you will have to get a flathead screwdriver. The reason why I have a perfect one, it's the perfect size, is because I buy it with my own money. Just by walking around, I mean, not with my own money from shopping, I walk around my yard and to see if there's any secrets of screwdrivers that they, they don't need it anymore. So yeah, that's what I find. I found this in my backyard, not with my own money. Mistake. So... Now, what you want to do is find clips like this. These are called clips, right? Because they do something. So, all you have to do is put it inside there and flip it open like that. Let me show you an example. Just try to get in there. Hold on. Oh, well, one more thing I forgot to tell you. I made a big old mistake. So what you want to do after when you uh, taking off your bottom of your smoke detector, when you're taking that off, make sure remove the battery. I mean, open the battery drawer and take out that battery. And then you can go access off, off of your clips here. That's why I did a mistake. So take take your clips here off of here. I know this could work, right? These could work.
There we go. Okay, there we go. We got one loose. See it? It's pushing out. That's clip right there. Now get the other ones. There we go. All I have to do is just that one. There we go. That was really easy. And this other one. There we go. Inside there. Inside there. There we go. Oh, have to take that off now. There we go. Take it off. Now, just in case, when you're done, take it off these three clips. One, two, three. And you'll see that your, your cover of your smoke detector will come off. And you lift up like that. And voila, take a look at that. So, so this is what it looks like inside of your smoke detector. You will have terminals right here that goes to your battery and your speaker and the cylinder and your button. So, Let's talk about the inside of a smoke detector. So, what's inside the smoke detector is the speaker, right? The speaker, the most important thing in the world to hear if it's going off or not. And we here we have uh Hold on. Here we have a door and and this is where the battery goes inside of and here's your button to press press it in and then you move the thing and move it back and that will lock it in place yeah so so let's talk about the cylinder right this is what it is right here you see the black cylinder right here you see it this is called a cylinder, right? And usually, hold on. Yeah, so usually, uh, this is what causes the smoke detector to go off. Uh, when, when, when the smoke goes inside this black thing, the cylinder, it goes off. It's because there may, there may be a fire. And it does not detect steam because steam is like, I don't know. Steam and smoke are like the same thing, but steam it, it, smoke detectors they do they do not detect steam, but sometimes <laughs> sometimes they de they detect steam, and yeah, and one more thing about this thing right here. So if you're wondering why is your smoke detector going off randomly when, when there's no smoke, it's because your cylinder inside here has a lot of fog or steam or dust collect in this stuff right here. See the holes? Sometimes you'll collect in there. Also, or the bottom, because the bottom, that's where the, the little tiny, tiny little molecules, they go about, uh, uh, they like go everywhere inside there and that'll cause the smoke detector to go off. And yeah, so right here, the whole brown thingy, right here, the whole brown thing, it's under the stuff. That's the motherboard to create a lot of memories and stuff. And yeah, so now this is the speaker, right? The speaker has surround sometimes on models like this. And yeah.
and the motherboard is a whole this is the whole motherboard right it has a lot of wires as like staples that's the uh, outside that's the inside the that's what it looks like on the outside see the green and this is what it looks like on the inside the brown yeah Okay, so now, now this smoke detector can handle up to, I uh, really forgot what temperature it is, well, maybe something, yeah, maybe something later, so yeah, and, and if you're wondering what's this, this is the cover of your smoke detector. It came. It comes off from here, and these are the the clips slots. One, two, three, and here's your button where the spot is, and that's the speaker grill. And yeah, that's how it works. So yeah, I hopefully you enjoyed my video about what's inside the smoke detector. And yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Let me put it back. Put it back. Oh, whoops, hold on. Hold on. There we go. Okay, got the smoke detector on. Back on its bottom again. You see it? And now put the 9 volt battery back inside here. Oops, do not hear the sound. There you go. There you go. Now, put it back on the ceiling. Put this back on your ceiling. Ceiling. And yeah. Okay, hold on, please. Hold on. Okay, gotta put the smoke detector on the ceiling now. There we go. So, all I have to do is put it on there and turn it righty tight. And this way is lefty loosey. Yeah. So, Hopefully you enjoyed my video of the smoke detector to see what's inside of it. And yeah, so goodbye everyone. We see us next time. That's how, I mean, that's what's in, that's what's inside the smoke detector SA-303. And yeah, so goodbye everyone. We see us next time. That's what's inside in the smoke detector SA-303. So goodbye.